Prepare to explore. Get out of the city and into an adventure that moves the whole family. Prepare to be moved. The all-new Nissan X-Trail. Birdie Blue Denim Specialist. Levi's. A brand. New. Rollers. Dr. Denim. SAFM News Briefing. Hi, it's Dan Flake here with the latest. It's a historic day for the AFL. Tasmania has officially been awarded the game's 19th licence. After decades of work to make it happen, CEO Gil McLaughlin says the state belongs in the league. Today, we close the loop. Today is about recognising that Tasmania belongs in our AFL. It's expected an AFL team from Tassie will enter the competition in 2028. Flags are flying at half-mast at fire stations across Queensland following the death of one of their own. Isabella Nash lost her life fighting a blaze at a factory in Slacks Creek south of Brisbane yesterday. A second firefighter remains in a serious but stable condition in hospital. Acting Fire and Emergency Services Commissioner Mike Wassing says an investigation continues. I can assure you that we want the answers too for Izzy for Leah, for their families and for their colleagues. Aussie Olympic boxer Harry Garside's released a statement following his arrest at Sydney Airport yesterday. He's been charged with common assault over an alleged incident in Sydney's eastern suburbs in March. On Instagram, he says the conduct of police took him completely by surprise and he categorically denies the allegations of domestic violence. The late Barry Humphreys will be farewell to the joint state funeral. PM Anthony Albanese has told UK reporters New South Wales and Victoria are set to share duties with the Commonwealth and the size of packets of paracetamol are said to be reduced from early 2025. It's hoped that... After this, there is no turning back. You sip the red can, the story ends. You sip the black can, you enter dreamland. And I show you just how good the truth can taste. Max Taste Challenge. Plenty of support coming in following news Tasmania has secured the AFL's 19th licence. We're expecting to see a team run out from 2028. High star Taylor Adams says it's well deserved. We're a national competition. I think Tasmania deserves a team. Logistically, it's a, it's a lot of work. The Roos have also confirmed they've got plans to play games in Tassie until at least the end of 2025. Still on footy in the return of St Kilda Spearhead, Max King could be just weeks away. Coach Ross Lyons optimistic the forward could play his first game of the season since next week against the Crows. Selling the family home, Miller, Juan and John put you first. This is SAFM Weather. A cloudy afternoon across the limestone coast, dropping to 7 degrees tonight. Back up to 16 tomorrow, though, rain possible. Want more local news? Get free breaking news about our community. Download the Listener app, search for the Limestone Coast and add to your favourites now.